A Twitter fisherman has caught this. Marine biologists say its formal name is Fromina. Yeah, and for all those that say they see no color, this is what it means to live no color. I don't know about you guys, but I saw this thing and I had only one thought. BMW has unveiled a new feature that allows their cars to change color, which comes in handy when you need to convince the traffic cop that you don't normally speed. You're just feeling particularly sexually frustrated right now. So go easy on the tickets, Tom. Personally, I'm waiting for the feature that allows the BMW logo to change into the Mercedes-Benz one. Because that's the only way you'll find me driving a BMW. Tesla, a company that's still trying to figure out if they're Elon Musk's main or side chick, if you have to ask. A man was pulled over for dangerous driving after falling asleep in his Tesla that was in self-driving mode. What is the point of self-driving mode? How do you guys expect me to work on my laptop, eat a hamburger, practice the clarinet? The drive home is the only time I get to practice. Guess I'll have to find another activity that I can do with just one hand while driving. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why is this so damn hard to get the spray to open up? Jeez. At least the car's getting clean. Rolling Stone magazine announces top 200 singers of all time and Celine Dion, Celine Dion off of it. I surrender. <laughs> Which is crazy because I drove all night, all by myself. Thinking about how Rolling Stone is taking chances with this incredible omission. Because if that's the way it is, this decision leads them down only one road. Because when somebody loves somebody like I love Celine, the power of love can pull water from the moon and je sais pas hits medley, my heart will go on. I lost a bit, almost had it. Point is, there aren't that many singers that have so many hits that you can do what I just did. So Celine deserves to be on that list, Rolling Stone. ChatGPT, the AI platform that's getting smarter from your dumb question. The OpenAI product has seen a recent investment of $1 billion from Microsoft, which means that in the future, we may see some skewed results. Who is the richest man in the world? Who gates? Oh, that's, that's not right. Which internet browser is the most loved in the world? Edge. Okay, I've got it, I've got it. Which billionaire released a virus that shut down the world for two years? Do you know what's the coolest use for ChatGPT that I've ever seen? People are actually having it write their essays and reports for them. Which is basically the new age version of copying the smart kid's homework. But don't get ahead of yourself. In a classroom, there's a smart kid, but there's also a snitch. Like this Princeton student who created an app that can tell if your essay has been written by AI. You know what they say about snitches. But let me help everybody out. ChatGPT, write me an app that makes sure that my ChatGPT written essay is snitch proof. You're welcome. Send me Anna De Arnes's number. I've tried like 15 times. Damn you, AI. Funeral homes, AKA Mother Nature's way of going, put it in the freezer. I'll get to it next week. A 46 year old Colorado funeral home owner has been sentenced to 20 years after it was found that she was defrauding her clients. Families thought that their loved ones were being cremated, but it turns out she was chopping them up and selling the body parts without their permission. Boy, is this lady as heartless as some of the bodies whose hearts she sold. In any case, I just hope that the rest of her staff also got punished. They deserve to be fired. But since no cremations were happening on site, I doubt any heads will roll, except for the heads that were not connected to bodies. A $3,300 AI-assisted self-driving pram has been unveiled in Vegas. Aimed that rich parents were already hands-off, but now you can be hands-off with high-tech technology. I mean, Marta's already raising the child. Might as well let Siri push the prayer. The prayer comes with cameras that capture motion, uphill assist, and can be paired with a smartphone if lost. That's right, all of the things that adequately replace a child's need for parents' love. Plus Marta, she, she's important. The pram also comes with cargo space that could hold up to six shopping bags. But if I'm spending $3,000 on a pram, best believe I'm not doing any of my own groceries. NASA, which is to America what a 25 year old is to Leonardo DiCaprio. That is left behind for a younger version that tweets. A 38 year old NASA satellite is set to fall back down to earth and has a one in 9,400 chance of hitting a person. In a totally unrelated matter, can somebody in the comments drop the exact coordinates? And trust me, it's nothing nefarious. It's got nothing to do with maybe going to the exact location and being slightly injured by this satellite in order to sue. It's been a tough January and Elon Musk can't be the only South African profiting from dead ass NASA. 